Happy Sunday, dear listener. Joseph Stalin and the Catacomb Church. Here we are, Joseph Stalin, the formidable Soviet leader. His dates are December 18th, 1878 to March 5th, 1953. The Catacomb Church emerged as a collective name for those representatives of the Russian Orthodox clergy, laity communities, monasteries and brotherhoods who moved to an illegal position since the 1920s. The term catacomb church refers not only to illegal communities, but specifically to those that rejected subordination to the acting patriarchal locum tenons metropolitan surges. Stratgorotsky, after 1927, and adopted anti-Soviet positions. The death of Patriarch Tignon in April 1925 led to unrest among the followers of the church. This division resulted in the formation of the Russian True Orthodox Church, also known as the Catacomb Church. The leader of the Catacomb Church was Archbishop Lazarus. He played a significant role in the spiritual life of this clandestine community. My listener, on this sacred day, as we gather in worship, let us indeed appreciate our freedom of worship, a precious gift often taken for granted. Joseph Stalin cast a long shadow over history. His regime wielded immense power, shaping the lives of millions. Yet within the folds of his iron grip, a hidden community thrived, the Catacomb Church. My dear listeners, may our worship, like theirs, rise above constraints, reaching toward eternity, and may we cherish our freedom, knowing that it was hard won by those who worshipped in shadows. May your heart be a sanctuary and your prayers ascend heaven like floral perfume. Amen.